All right, welcome to uh, the walkthrough of how to install the Paramount CMS 2.0. First thing you're going to do is you're going to come to the invidtech.com website. Okay, so you come here, you'll see this screen pop up. You're going to go ahead and click on your support tab. From the support tab, you're going to go ahead and click on where it says Paramount. And you're going to click on where it says PC downloads. Now we'll have a link in the, uh, in the info section of this video. Uh, that will take you directly to this page if need be. So if you're looking at this and you want to pull up this page, this is strictly for the CMS 2.0 to be used on laptops and desktops. This is not for your phone. Okay. So uh, you're going to go ahead and I want you to note down this information that is highlighted in red here and black. All right. So you need, you're going to need this information. Definitely mark this down. Okay. This is going to be your login information for the program. All right, so you're going to go to where it says download here. Okay, you're going to run the download. It's going to be two zipped files. Okay, so once it finishes downloading, it's going to be two zipped files. So there's going to be one labeled the client and one la labeled the server. You need both installed on the computer. Okay, so you're going to install both the client and the server. Uh, the server runs in the background, and that's what kind of powers and gives all the secret sauce on the actual client and how it works. Okay. So ensure that you do have both. Okay, so once the download finishes, you'll open up your downloads folder. Okay, open up your downloads folder, unzip it, run your install just like any other program on your PC. Okay, once you install both programs, okay, you will open up the, the program. Okay, so in your search bar, I mean, you'll have a, you'll have a desktop icon. Um, but if you don't see it, you can always come to your search bar on, on Windows and type in uh, Paramount and it should be the first thing that pops up here. It's gonna be, this is what the icon looks like, okay? So you're gonna open up that icon. And once you open it up, you actually won't get this screen. I'm gonna back us out here just so I can show you what you will get. You're going to get this screen. Okay, it's gonna be a login screen. Now, remember I told you to note down that information. This is where you're gonna put that info in. Okay, so the username to get into the program. This is nothing to do with your recorder, nothing to do with your tablet, nothing to do with any of that. This is just strictly to get into the program. Okay, so the username is gonna be admin. Your password is gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six. The authentication server is not gonna be filled in here. You're gonna fill that in. It's one, two, seven, dot, zero, dot, zero, dot, one. And then the port you're gonna leave at six, zero, zero, three. Okay, now, what I suggest that we don't even need to deal with this. Uh, you just check the box for remember password, check the box for auto login. And now going forward, it will automatically log you in. Okay. You're going to click the login button. And there you go. Okay. So that is how you install the CMS software. Okay. Please tune into some of our other videos to see how to add a device to the CMS um, and uh, various other things. Okay. We've got a lot of quick hitters. Uh, and things that, that could be of, be of use to you. Thank you.